Okay, listen. Let me tell you something. I really do this. Be That's all I'm kidding. That's all I'm kidding. That's just how I live. Money and pretty women. Hey, y'all. It's all of destiny. Where Dollar Tree at? There it is. Ponytail is gone. This is what we finna do. I'm finna go in Dollar Tree. I'm gonna see what I can find to lay my wig with. Only using Dollar Tree products. Fingers crossed. I feel like I'm facing the wind. Oh, wait. We're gonna do this budget friendly. Let me see how much cash. Hold on. I'm scared to go in my purse. Somebody might see me go in my purse. Somebody bump. Casually being awkward as people walk by, but you know I do this. Follow me on Instagram. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, please. I'm making a fool of myself in public. Let me get my mask on. Be right back. Let's see what we can find. I need this for dramatic effect. Nah, maybe I need that for dramatic effect. <laughs> that. I don't want to push. Okay, give it to me. Don't, don't, don't. Let's find the hair care stuff, folks. So what you do when you get a wig? You, I need a stocking cap. I wonder if they're gonna have a stocking cap. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Girl, they ain't got nothing. Uh -uh, I need a comb. See, my mama want to come over here to this one in Bartley. At least the one I go to got combs. Oh my God. You just gotta cut it on the press record and say, "Hey, what's up?" See, I don't have no thing like that, and so I have you. I got a five hundred. You can order the tripod off of Amazon. Oh. And then you just hold it like this. I like this though, cause I can sit it up. And see, and I don't on know the shelf. The only way you learn to edit is by editing. You just gotta, you know, try it. Hey, oh, this is cute. So you would uh, be back. Give me some gel just in case, I guess. And then I saw these little hair clips with the fur on them. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh, this one pretty. I know what we need. We're gonna go to the makeup aisle. We're gonna need tweezers. Black wig caps, there's nothing I could do with that. I'm wondering if I should get the two pack of combs instead of one pack. Probably this. They got four in this one. Now they all the same though. I need a variety pack. I don't know what I might need. Girl, somebody took the combs. Mm -mm. This is my shower comb. I got one of these. This exact one actually. That's a wave cap. What are we gonna do? That's a 12 pack. Mm -mm. What we gonna do, y'all? We ain't got much to work with. Something to do our edges with. Okay, let's get this one. Good, cause I know we're not gonna be able to find an edge brush here. <laughs> Just in case we need powder in our parts. Flawless face powder. Okay, this may work. What other options do we have? If they got a concealer, we'll really be good. Oh, I'm gonna need a brush to put the powder in my part with. Get me. Whoa. Oh, <gasps> Yes, we can plug. I'm too close to have missed that. We got the goods, some of the goods. I need to go buy another Dollar Tree though because we don't have everything. Make sure my earring didn't fall out. Oh, I'm gonna have to count my items because I grabbed some other things that I kind of just needed outside of filming this video. So I only want to spend $20 on this entire challenge just to make it a challenge because of course you can go on Dollar Tree and rack up. The point is to try to make it like interesting. I'm gonna see how much I got left to spend at this hot 20. <laughs> yeah, I'm broke for my challenge technically. I got, let me see. What is a challenge? It's, I'm trying to only use $20, but since uh, I bought uh, that other stuff uh, now. I'm talking about you on your budget then. Yeah. Yeah. Three I okay, got I got four dollars. Hold on, let me be more dramatic with this. People with dramatic channels get out of views. So you know I gotta do what I gotta do. Okay guys, we made it to the next Dollar Tree. Don't go no. <laughs> please have it, please have it, please have it, please have it. They don't have foaming mousse. Crunch free finishing spray. Girl, what else will I do with this? Y'all ain't got no mousse. You mean to tell me Dollar Tree they normally have mousse and have a whole stash full of hair products. Don't got no hair products. Is that what you're telling me? Hairspray. Okay, hairspray. I want it mousse though. <gasps> oh, so my God, mousse. We in business. We gotta pick because we can't spend our 20 on two of them. I'm gonna go with this. Hold that spray. Hold on, because I don't got a dollar to waste either though. Oh, we good. Oh, yes, sir. We straight. Girl, if they got a stocking cap, it's lit. Okay, no stocking cap. Just old boy. Uh, Marion knockoff. Oh, goodness. Thank you. Got some more goods. Not for the video, but I need that for vlogging. We're back and we got the goods. Okay, actually it's two days later. Got everything from Dollar Tree. 
I got this brush. We obviously were not gonna find an edge brush in Dollar Tree. Oh, trusty. Colgate, I got name brand from Dollar Tree. These were just cute. I wanted them, these little scrunchies. They look like they cost more than a dollar too. See the quality on that? A two pack of these red tail combs. It's cute, so I wanted these little hair clips. I got some tweezers, a Sassy Plus Chic. This is like a known brand at Dollar Tree. LA Looks Extreme Sport Hair Gel. We'll land the edges or something, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Since we can't use the got to be glue, I got this hairspray. It's by Bella Lynn. It holds your style, but hopefully it will hold our lace in place, okay? <laughs> Gotta have the mousse, because I'm going to try to do like glueless. Obviously, I ain't got no glue. The Salon Selectives Plumping Mousse all day. Anti-frizz, weightless control, and curl defining. Crunch free, extra hold, and it's got the number three. It's like the highest one. It's Elf Flawless Face Powder and Light Beige. I ain't have many options when it came to the colors. We're going to see what this do for me. Get in my part with, so I went in the makeup section, and I got the Smoky Liner Brush. This is by Wet n Wild. Cruelty free, gluten free, vegan. Just a small little brush. Yeah, but they were cute, and I wanted them. It's got like little curls on it. I like that a lot. Oh, some serum. This is the L'Oreal Sunflower Oil. I had a $20 budget, so I think I'm well under that. It's time for the star of the show, folks. I haven't even opened it yet. I didn't get scissors. Give me, give me, give me. Ooh. Dramatic effect. I always have to clean up later for making a mess. Today's video, guys, is sponsored by. Ooh. Today's video is sponsored by Wild African. Y'all know I love working with Wild African. Their wigs are always on point. Special thank you to them for sponsoring today's video. We get this little booklet with everybody's favorite YouTubers on it. It has some hair care tips. Uh, if you want to send it back, don't cut the lace. All of that good stuff. It's the Wiggy Wig. <gasps> yes! This is what they did not have at Dollar Tree. I was just like, I could use pantyhose, but I'm like, I know why I'm African. They gonna give me something. <laughs> Thank goodness they gave me a wig cap. Hold on, cause companies like stealing videos. So this is how we gonna do this. So if somebody tag me on Instagram and be like, look at you, Destiny. I'm gonna be like, look at the box in the back. Looky. I love making myself do extra editing. So I'm gonna put all the specs about the hair over here in this empty space. I'm kinda nervous. Ooh, it's pretty. Very much given text laxed. So it's not silky silky. I like that a lot. Like if you wanted to kind of blow this out and curl it, it would definitely give you I straightened my natural hair vibes. So inside we do have the combs, the adjustable band. It's kind of like a bra strap. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the second one just like that and then you can undo the sides as well if you feel like you don't need it we got lots of space on the inside so that's good let's work with the hair before we put it on let's do that pause i'm going to take a picture i'm going to put it onto my instagram so y'all can see if people doubt me or not ask my instagram followers if they think i can slay a wig I only using dollar tree hair products follow me on instagram <laughs> So if you look really close, you can see the texture in this wig, which is going to give us a really natural look. Also, I did the nails myself. Be sure to check out the video. Quick look at the hairline before I begin. So this comb, I wish it was a little more pointy. I'm just gonna take out some in the front and I'm gonna pluck behind that actually. These tweezers, they a little weak. See, y'all was just thinking they was cute. I can hold the hair back with this. <laughs> Barely. Barely, but. I forgot to check for the actual clips. Sometimes they do have clips in there. No, I lost the tweezers. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, here we go. These tweezers kind of weak, I ain't gonna lie. These ain't pulling nothing. Oh my God, what was I thinking? I'm gonna get it done. I figured it out. You gotta be really aggressive. She ain't gonna like it, but you gotta put your hand on her head like this, grab the hair, and then you gotta snatch real hard. It's gonna take you twice as long to pluck, but you know, we getting some hair out. It's a workout. So I do have this spray bottle that I got from Dollar Tree as well. I'm gonna use that to wet the hair, which helps for plucking, and I'm just gonna, you know, zone out and get this done like to pause every now and then. That looks pretty good to me. All right, all right, I like it. And this is about how much hair we took out with the tweezers. And we're gonna start from the back and just begin flat ironing the hair, curling it at the same time. This little thing gonna take a minute. I'm gonna take the little serum that we got, you know the name brand product, travel size, shout out to Dollar Tree. And ooh, that's a lot, so I'm gonna put that over all of the hair. I'm gonna secure that with my little clippy clip. I mean, a uh, little scrunchy thing. I wish they had chasing combs at Dollar Tree. Listen, sis, I need you to sit 
still somebody come get her so the way that i'm curling the hair i'm taking medium sized sections taking some of that oil and then just applying it to the hair you can see the texture within the curls i don't want to get rid of that i'm going to run the flat iron through one time to straighten and then the second time i'll use the flat iron to curl and to make sure my curls hold i'm going to hit it with this hairspray look at that Y'all can't tell me this ain't giving Sunday morning, getting ready for church, going for Easter service vibes. Tell me it ain't giving that. <laughs> I'm curling the hair in a backwards motion. So towards the right, I'm curling back towards the left. And then when I get to the left side, I'm curling back towards the right. Basically make all of your curls go towards the center of your head. So I'm trying to slick my hair back. I forgot to get a hairbrush. I only got like a wig brush. This gel is working really good. Look how slick that's getting my hair. And I picked a good brush too. Now some two brushes have those little rubber pieces in them. You just want all bristles. Oh yes. I need to do my natural hair with this. Wow. Okay, we off to a good start. Real quick. In order to frame my face, see how my parting and everything looks. I can do that better when it's on my head. I noticed that the Bi African didn't really put as much lace as they normally put like when you cut off the excess. I'm gonna take these combs in the back and just move them towards the inside. I'm going to help it to be really snug since we're doing like a glueless install. Obviously I can't wear this wig with the lace on here like that. I'm using scissors. I like to hold it by the elastic band. Since I got a ponytail, I'm gonna actually sit it on top of my ponytail to help flatten it out a little bit. If you wanna do a ponytail with your wig, put your little ball lower. But since I had just finished wearing a braided ponytail, this is how I had mine. Then I take this comb, tuck that underneath your hair. Like, uh-oh. You can see my stocking cap. Okay, we're gonna figure something out. And we're just gonna finish curling real quick. At this point, I'm wondering what this e.l.f. concealer is gonna do for me. I mean powder. It came with this little puff. I forgot to get um a different type of brush. Girl! Oh! Oh, oh, what? And I ain't doing nothing. At the door, you see someone. <laughs> That you know, and they ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. It look good on this, but not on me. Why am I still going? Girl! <laughs> mm -mm. Let me tell you something. I'm trying to build it. Okay, um, it's a little darker. It's gonna have to do though. And try to put it on the lace. Rub it on here like that. Just mush it on. <laughs> try to put it on here. To try to make it at least look like I got something going on. Stocking cap method. Probably not. I probably could do the stocking cap method with it though. Side part me please. Gotta finish curling the front. I think we're gonna come up with something cute. I think. If y'all drag me for using a clip, y'all just don't want to see me succeed <laughs> at this point. And curl back. Squeezing really tight and pulling down. And still curling up at the same time and pulling down at the same time. That's how we do that. And spiral it back. I'm gonna hit it with my $100 holding spray. And let it sit. See that? I can't do that. And I didn't wanna do the stocking cap method. Let's see what this is about. Stocking cap method is a way to get the cap to stick to your forehead and then you're able to cut off the thick band. Yeah, it wasn't working out too well. I don't know what's about to happen, but I'm about to go ahead and cut this. Wish me luck. I'm kinda nervous. I really ain't trying to like pull it up at all. Cause this thick part is just not doing it for me. I doubt if my side tabs are down good, but if I can just get that middle to look a little bit better than what it is, then I'll be good to go. This is when we finna have a problem because it's gonna slide. No, like, watch your wig, cause you, it keeps sliding. They've been sliding since day one. No, 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 don't run away. There's that. <laughs> I should have did the little hole thing right here to make it stay. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. <laughs> what did I think that was gonna do? <laughs> girl, girl, I know it didn't do me like that. And it's only hanging on. <laughs> Once I cut this, it's gonna be a wrap. I know it. Girl. Quit playing. <laughs> YouTubers be thinking they can do anything. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> okay, 
and listen. Let me tell you something. I'm not finna play these games. How would this wig look without a stocking cap at all? Okay, it's the no stocking cap for me. I'ma tuck the combs into my hair. That make sure none of my hair is in the front, right? Now, for the star of the show, we're gonna take the mousse. Extra much. We're gonna put a whole bunch of mousse, right? Cause I gotta be sure. <gasps> too late, too late. We already made a mistake. Too late. I'm gonna use something to hold down the hair as well. I'm gonna take the comb and start combing the hair back real cute like this. And since I got that mousse on there, I can easily move this part now. I'm gonna take a little bit of the holding spray. Go ahead and remove the lace. I'm not getting as close as I can. I'm gonna go ahead and do that later. Taking out a few pieces in the front that we'll use later for baby hair. And then I'm going to use the mousse to further lay the lace down. Tie that down for... Since this is a glueless method, I'm going to let that sit for about 30 minutes. I was like, let me do my makeup while I wait. And to get the longer pieces of hair out of the way, I'm just going to trim those down. I'm back, a more leveled up version of myself. I went ahead and filmed this makeup look while I was letting the lace really sit for a really long time. Make sure y'all check out both videos, by the way. The little elf powder that we have, the brush that we got. My lace is lifting up a little bit and I need to cut off some more of it. Give me. All right, it's really small. So it's gonna be perfect for just trying to get in this parting space and the fact that it's really light like this, it'll help my part to stand out, which is kind of what we want. Oh, thank goodness. Yay! Something is treating me right. I'm gonna have to keep this brush for this. It's perfect for this. The size and everything. Doing this will prevent me from having to do more plucking because that little tweezer thing, mm -mm. it makes it look even more realistic when you kind of do like a little C type of parting. To really lay it on there heavy instead of sweeping, you can just tap. Okay. Where's our toothbrush? I think I'm gonna use some of this gel. I'm gonna just put some, ooh, that's too much. Put some on my hand, tap into the toothbrush. I'm gonna swoop the edges first and then decide what I need to cut because I won't be able to put it back. And since I have stiletto nails, kind of do like that to lift up the hair a little bit. And whatever else I don't need, I can sweep it back into the lace. I'm gonna try to do as best as I can. When you use an edge brush, you have a comb on one side. So I'm gonna have to make it work with just this. Someone please comment down below. Let me know if you've ever purchased scissors in Dollar Tree, even though I forgot to get them. It'll at least let us know that these were allowed. Just in case. It's the highlight for me. I'm gonna have to use this comb to sort of make something work. Oh baby. Yo baby. Okay, next I'm gonna take some more of this sunflower oil by L'Oreal. I need to change my top so y'all can really see the hair well. Girl, time for the big reveal, folks. I recurled a few more pieces, but I know y'all didn't wanna watch me do that over and over. I'll be there for you. At this point, you can't tell me nothing. At this point. Excuse me. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me. Give me my brush, please. Thank you. Mm -mm. I ain't finna mess my curls up with that brush. Y'all, this look like I blowed out natural hair. The texture on this hair is everything. Not to say that I don't love a good silky wig. Oh, the more that we can fake it, we done made it. <laughs> wow. Mm. You said what? People who shop at Dollar Tree what? Huh? Oh, I thought somebody that don't shop at Dollar Tree said something. Just in case y'all don't say it in the comments, I do this. It's simple as that. Girl, it's very much giving blowout. Natural hair. At this point, who gonna tell me what? You need what to lay your wig? You said you ran out of what? Got to be. Listen, you better go to Dollar Tree and go and find this mousse. You don't need no guy to be. <laughs> Girl, I really do this. This ain't even Ratchet Destiny. I told y'all what I'm finna do with her. This me, guy. If you're ever on vacation, if you ever forget your items, if you're spending too much on products, listen, you don't need all this. You need time, you need patience, you need to pull up to Dollar Tree and go and get what you need for your hair. Again, special thank you to Wild African for sponsoring this video. Wild African be showing your girl love. Okay, I'm gonna have all the details about this hair in the description box down below. Definitely be sure to check it out if y'all wanna get a wig like this. It really looks like my natural hair. <sighs> Using this for my edge brush honestly brought back memories. This used to be my edge brush before they came out with like the fancy ones. Obviously, I can't link any of the products that I use down below because it's Dollar Tree. They're not linkable. If Dollar Tree ever starts sponsoring people, I need to be first in line. <laughs> Dollar Tree makeup. This is just sitting here for a couple of months. Get this video to 3,000 likes. Somebody DM me when this video has 3,000 likes. 
and me and Bone are gonna do the Dollar Tree makeup challenge. So let me know what you all think of my hair down below. Dollar Tree does have flexi rods if you wanna take it a step further to maintain these curls. Let me know. Now it's time for the glueless test. It's actually the next day by the way. My lace is laid but it's glueless so I can definitely take this right off at night and go to bed. And if you go ahead and put your flexi rods in and just leave it just like that, then you'll be good to go the next day. I hope y'all enjoyed this one and as always, I thank you all so much for watching. Bye! I really do this! Period.